um, defect or bug life cycle so once you find out any um, defect after that you have to raise a new bug so once you log any so that all these steps are basically in HPLM but if you are using any other tool like DevOps you will not get all these uh, steps actually okay there we have only one or three options like uh, assigned done that's it but in HPLM you will get all these steps like new assigned open fix uh, pending uh, retest uh, retest verified close but now we are uh, mostly working on the cloud base so we are not getting all these uh, steps but to, uh, for the interview point of view you can um, just understand what is new if you have assigned a new bug that status should be new if you assign it to any developer you will change that status to assign and the uh, name of the developer later that uh, after assigning you have to change the status of the bug to open so if it's a valid uh, bug uh, they will fix it otherwise they will reject it if in case that uh, defect um, doesn't lie on that sprint so they can defer that bug okay that is called a deferred means they are not going to fix that bug in the current release okay once they fix it uh, next one is the pending retest once the developer fix that uh, bug he will change the status to pending retest after that um, you have to retest that bug whether that uh, bug got fixed or reopened so again you have to uh, change um, uh, change the status of bug to reopen and again assign it to a developer so once you have verified that bug got fixed just close it okay so this is called a bug life cycle uh, madam in the deferred as you said the uh, developer may not fix the uh, defect in current uh, sprint so what should be the reason reason can be any like sometime environment related issues we are getting like or maybe sometime uh, de whatever uh, data you are testing in any specific environment same kind of data we are not getting in production okay or any other uh, pre-prod environment so uh, in that case they can defer that uh, bug okay so once uh, they can just mention once we get uh, same kind of data we'll fix it otherwise if the uh, same kind of setup is not present in the current working environment they mark it as a default and 